Yeah. I think this is it. Put me on the list. We so VIP. Go ahead, take a sip. Cruising on the strip. Let's go take a ride. Hey, we too legit. We don't even try. 100 meter dash on the track. Where we at, though? Don't be trying to smash on the gas. Just relax, yo. They say don't be gone for too long. We be bad, yo. They say don't be average. Feeling like a classic. Yeah. Let me tell you what I'm feeling like. Oh, my tongue is green. <laughs> Y'all, I've been juicing and I've been making a lot of green juices as well as drinking chlorophyll. So it makes my tongue green. So if you guys see that in my videos, that's why. But y'all, the skin benefits as well as the health benefits are so good. So I can't stop. But y'all just gonna have to see a green tongue. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Miss Naturally Mary here. And I want to first start off by saying that you all are the bomb. I literally have the best community on the planet. You guys are so loving and so supportive. I just love that. Thank you all so much for the well wishes on our home. We really appreciate you guys. And if you haven't seen our new home video, be sure to check that out. I just wanted to say that really quickly, but without further ado, let's get into today's video. All right, y'all, so let's get into this video. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you all a unit from Y Wigs. This is what the packaging looks like. And I'm really excited about this particular unit. It actually reminds me of my Coily signature unit with the bangs, but this one is less expensive. So if you're looking for a more affordable option to my signature unit, then I'd highly recommend going with this one. And when I took it out of the package, y'all, I was like, hold up. This unit already looks really, really good. You don't have to wash it or anything. The curls look so amazing. Usually when you get kinky curly units, I feel like the curl definition isn't as on point as it is after you actually wash and define the curls. But the cool thing about this one is that the curls were already defined and look the way they would if you had already washed and gone through the process of using your Felicia Leatherwood detangling brush and all. So I didn't even have to do that. I literally just sprayed my no itch grow spray and this is a spray that i often recommend as a refresher for your curly hair i feel like it not only refreshes your curly hair but it also gives it a really nice sheen and it makes it look so natural i believe there's glycerin in this product so that's a natural humectant that helps to preserve moisture in the hair and it just makes the hair look so lush so i spray this on it and i feel like that alone just woke the curls up a little bit and gave it the really nice luster that i was looking for so i didn't really have to do a whole lot of works with this unit at all. I didn't actually wash it and I feel like the shape that it comes in y'all Oh my goodness, the Diva Cut don't have nothing on this unit. If you're a natural that's been exploring the notion of getting a Diva Cut potentially, especially one with bangs, I'd highly recommend trying this unit first and then maybe cutting your natural hair. But even if you decide that you just wanna wear this unit and not even wear your natural hair out, this is a great protective style. So I just went through the process of actually spraying that on. Now I did go in and define the coils on some areas of the bang and even the hair on the side using my my melanin hair care. Have y'all tried this leave-in, y'all? This leave-in is so amazing. It works so well on my natural hair as well as my kinky curly units, and I love it. And what I tend to do with my kinky curly units is focus it on the ends of the hair, and I feel like it helps to create a really nice coil. So if you're looking for that definition and you don't actually want to go in with your tangling brush to achieve it, you can just apply this, and y'all, it's gonna look so great. So I'm gonna show you all what I did to the hair, how I went about defining it, getting the added sheen without having to wash it. I'm gonna show you all that process now and then I'll come back on. Oh, you could be my little princess peach And I could be a Super Mario The two of us were always meant to be I know I never should've Looks 
so so bomb i love the way it turned out so this is what the curls look like in the front and they look so so good even in the back there's just a bit of frizz that was created but y'all it looks so good and i feel like it makes the unit look even more natural so this unit is a lace closure unit so it's very beginner friendly and i love that about it so if you're someone who doesn't know how to cut lace off or if you don't enjoy cutting a 13 by 6 lace frontal then this is going to be a great option for you as well it's so much easier and with the bangs whether you get it right or not with how you cut it it won't really matter so i love that it does come with cones and it has an adjustable strap and i like that this cap is really stretchy and breathable so right now i'm just going to cut the lace off in the front i'm also going to tint the lace in this area here and then i'll come back on and we're going to install this unit and it's going to be so easy that's what i love y'all know i've been telling you guys about these pre-tied head wraps and i feel like those are so easy you can just grab and go especially if you're running errands or something these come in handy i'll be sure to link it down in the description box but this is another unit just like the headband wigs that i often wear those are my go-to because i feel like they're grab and go units this is going to be a grab and go unit and y'all know for the summer we're doing the most so many of you guys are out of the house and you don't want to have to spend hours doing your hair this is going to save you some time y'all this unit is going to save you time i lost my way i took a wrong turn was living in vain the only thing doing me right all right, so now that I've cut the lace off and tinted the lace, let's try this bad boy on. All right, so let's take off the head wrap. And I just have my natural hair currently braided in about five plaits. I actually went to the salon recently and saw my girl Kia. That video will be coming up soon. But I only went this time for natural hair undercare for my wig prep. And so this is how I generally wear my hair under my wigs. Y'all know I don't do cornrows or anything. I don't have time for that. And I feel like it creates too much tension. So I usually just plait my hair in five braids. And so I'm just going to put on a stocking cap now. And I actually found the ones that match my skin tone really well on Amazon. On. I'll try to remember to link these as well so I'm just gonna put this one on and I like to pull it up to about right here in case I want to slick my edges down or anything or expose those so now let's try the unit on and I believe I got my unit in length 18 oh yes honey yes 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 do y'all see that oh my goodness this is so cute I love the way they cut the bangs and everything. I'm going to pull it forward a little more though. So I don't want them to look as short as they did. And what I like about this unit as well is that you don't actually have to glue it down. You just insert the combs on the side and the one in the back and you're good to go. And this fits so, so well. I love the shape of it and that it's in color 1B. Y'all know I recently got my hair dyed and this is like the perfect color. So if I wanted to actually wear my edges out, they match. If I wanted to do like a half up, half down hairstyle, I could also do that with this unit. So right now I'm just going to fluff it out, probably pick it and get it to look the way that I desire. And then I'll come back on. Y'all, where was this unit when I big chopped? Like, literally, if I had a unit like this that looks so gorgeous and, like, it styled so well, I would have been so happy. This is, like, my natural hair goal to have this fullness, this shape. It looks so good, y'all. And it's priced really well. I love this. This is everything. This is probably the easiest unit that I've had to install as well. And it looks so natural. This literally looks like this is me. They need to name this one Mary. <laughs> it is gorgeous. All right, so now I'm going to go change my outfit and everything. Show you all the final look. I think I do want to add some more of this spray to it. Now that I've kind of manipulated it some to give it some more shine. And then I'll do a full spin and show you guys what it looks like. But for those who recently big chop, if you're someone who's bald, you deal with alopecia or anything, let me tell you. And if you don't have edges, like, look, your edges are not showing at all. And you could actually take some of the front 
and just pull it behind your ear and conceal your edges. But if you wanted to show your edges, you could actually move some of the bangs over. And I'll show you guys that in a moment. You can move some of the bangs, have your edges slip down, put some edge control on, and that will be a look as well. But I'm going to go change my outfit. And then I'll show you all what that looks like. But yes, honey. Yes, yes, yes. This looks bomb. To me, this is so fly. Y'all, I'm like, Kiki, get into it. Get into it, y'all. I've been trying to decide on a hairstyle for my birthday, and I don't know, y'all. Looking at this one, I'm like, man, this looks so good. I love it so much. I wish I could see the entire outfit. I'll try to include a clip of what my entire outfit looks like, but y'all. I am so happy with how this turned out. And I did not have to do much work at all. I love those easy units that you can just grab, throw on. And in no time you look like you spent hours getting your look together. This is so nice. Look at this. Listen, y'all, the stylist understood the assignment. Whoever did this, they did such a great job. I don't feel like my hair is too heavy or anything. So I feel like it would be great for the summer and just any season. And it's so easy. Wow, y'all, I'm literally blown away. I haven't seen myself with a kinky curly unit with bangs in a while. And I'm in love with this one. No edges out, none. So you could be completely bald under here and nobody would even know. We love that for us, right? <laughs> and I like how much lace they included. So this area here, if you were to bend down, it's gonna look like it's your hair, unless somebody's all in your scalp, but it looks real. Like it looks so real. I am in love. And you could absolutely wash it and everything, but I wanna see how long I can maintain these curls the way that they are, cause I feel like they look so good now. And I can't stop touching it. It feels soft and everything. I'm so surprised by this because y'all know I am constantly telling y'all, wash your units. Don't leave the curls as is because they won't look good right out of the package. You won't see the full potential. But y'all, this unit right out of the package, let me tell you, it's ready to go. All right, now let me show you guys what it looks like if you were to tuck your edges down on one side and have that side exposed. So you could just take some hair and position it to the opposing side. I could probably just take my braid and just pull it back like that. Yeah, that could work. All right, so I'm going to be using the 24-hour Edge Tamer, and this is by Ebon New York. So this is what it looks like. I did get this on Amazon as well. Okay, so I'm going to slick this side down. And I tend to use this edge control if I'm not using gel, and I feel like it gives me a really nice hold. Okay, I'm just gonna pull this forward. And I'm gonna take my braid and I'm just gonna pin it right here. See, I'm not taking it and pulling it all the way over this area, which you could do that. I'm gonna take it probably about halfway that section and then I'm just gonna pin it back. And that's just another quick way that you can style it. It's simple and easy, but what I like is that I don't actually have to take my braids down in order to achieve the style, but you could absolutely just take your hair down on the side and then just pin it back that way. That's another option, but I'm trying to keep my hair braided as long as possible to protect my hair. All right, y'all, that's the end of this video. I hope you all thoroughly enjoyed it. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Also follow me on Instagram and my new Facebook page. Check the description box. I'll have all the links and specifications provided down there. I love you guys, and I'll see you all in my next tutorial. Bye, guys.